Um, I want to talk about um, one of the things that was also brought up to you, sidewalks, right? Yes. Small thing, it seems, but honestly, how we get around in the city is really important. Yes. Right? Older people walk, use the sidewalks. Mm -hmm. Younger people might bike. Right. Right? Um, some people still use their car on a regular basis. Right. But um, we have a thing called Complete Streets. Right. We have, um, and we have a bus service that's seemingly under threat right, right. now with the move from Kennedy Plaza and the promises mm -hmm. that are being made there, which don't seem all that convincing. But right. So do you want to talk a little bit about Try, you also mentioned you have an electric car, so I'm yes. gonna throw that in there. So, like into the mix, like so. What are your general thoughts about getting around Providence? Why do we make this a city of the future? Yeah, so I think one thing uh, we should hold our apartments accountable to uh, transitioning into this green economy. Um, my apartment complex is not, you know, we have one of the, I'm in one of the biggest complexes in the city yeah. and they do not have any charging infrastructures for my electric vehicle. Um, second, we need to move away from, yeah. Sorry. we need to move away from the dependence on vehicles, right? We, you know, and, and, and third, we need to create a more bikeable, a more walkable city, um, again, by creating buy-in with our neighbors. When I knock doors, surprisingly, there's a lot of you know, aging folks that, that bike as well. Yeah. Um, and that's their main transportation. And they actually, that's their, that's how they get out. That's how they enjoy the community is by biking and walking. Yeah. And so we also need to, you know, again, ask for support from our state legislators. Our state legislators need to have a program similar to Boston where, you know, they are also putting in, um, you know, and making our streets more walkable and bikeable. And I think that, you know, I'm going to be able to have the juice to make that happen. Um, I've made a lot of connections from when I was running the pack with our state legislators, and I plan to continue those relationships as a city councilor.